हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू स्टार्ट क्वेरियम चिलर वर्जन सिक्स पार्ट टू आई होप यू हैव सीन क्वेरियम चिलर वर्जन सिक्स पार्ट वन बिकॉज दिस पार्ट इज लिंक्ड विद दैट वन लेट स्टार्ट फ्रॉम हेयर आई हैव रिमूव द ओल्ड ऑपरेटर दिस वन इट हैज एस एस स्टेनलेस स्टील सिक्सटी फिट लेंथ पाइप सिक्स एम एम डाया इट वॉज वर्किंग बेस्ट फ्रॉम लास्ट टू ईयर्स बट नो देर इज अ लीकेज इन दिस पाइप that's why i have to remove this and modify the system no i will not use this one ss pipe i will use copper pipe outside ss box for that i brought this ss box from the shop if you will go on shop then you will see different size 1 2 3 4 this height and dia based on that we have this number i brought this four number because it fit on my conditions must check this box with magnet here i have magnet if i will connect the magnet here it should not attach if it will be ss box then it will not connect but if it's iron then it will connect with magnet and you will not use that one because there can be rust and there will be a big problem i have checked this with magnet that this is ss stainless steel box there is no chance of rust but still i fill water in it and keep it for one month i put the water on 4 february 2023 and after 26 223 after 22 days i change the water just change the water did not rinse it just i want to see if there is salt deposit or anything happened inside this box then i will not use this one but it work best only one point i find these three points where this is rivet or i think some joint used here at this side and at this side this is not steel one so when i check after one month here i see the rust at these three points so to solve this issue on permanent basis i use this magic epoxy this one mix both and put here like this no there is no chance of water to touch that iron piece and there is no chance of rust this point is its cover so for that i went on sanitary shop and from there i bring this one this is 6 inch dia pipe and closer this one also have this cover with rubbers so water will not leak so now if i check its inner dia is 5.5 inch its height is near about 78 or 80 mm now if i put it here like this here i have too much space upside so i have to cut this one i cut this one from downside 30 mm and the remaining one here about 48 or 47 mm remaining now if i take this upper side and put it here now it's very close as it's placed on this no gap and here i have little bit space from where i can fill the epoxy resin this one i will use these two solutions epoxy resin a solution and b solution i need a tape to put here otherwise this resin epoxy will come out very carefully i have to fix here this one so for that i have this one aluminum tape you can purchase this from ac spare part shops or you can use this paper tape i have used this aluminum tape because it stick very hard very difficult to remove this one still little bit epoxy resin is coming out from this one because when i press this there become little bit hole that's why i have to very carefully fix it here next the same part which i have removed from here 30 mm this one i cut this from here because this plastic is very hard and difficult to break so after cutting as per my requirement i make this l shape connectors to hold this one after putting this one in my chiller place here and then i mark the points and fix it here to, to join this one here i use here this pvc glue which we use to join the pvc pipes and then also connect two screws 1 by 2 cross 10 is the number of this screw which i have used here same this side same one this side 
and then also connect this screw here approximately 25 or 30 mm solution I have taken from this solution 1 epoxy resin A part and this same 25 same amount from part B and mix in this box when I mix this it become little bit thin so it's difficult to move it they use this hair dryer to make it hot like this I use this one make it hot after getting hot it become thin like water also I use this hair dryer at this place in the full round to make this one hot when this become hot after that then I put this solution here at this point I was thinking that if I can cut this shape here till here because this is the bottom this box steel box is coming till here so epoxy resin is filled till here it means if I can cut this one then it will be easy to fill the solution also it will be easy to see what is happening inside and what is the level after filling this leave it for 24 hour and then now 24 hour passed and now it's fully hard it will not open now as proxy resin came out little bit from here and it's full hard and when I remove this it break like this in small pieces so here two points one I can use this paper tape then it will be easy to remove this one because it will not break like this aluminium tape is breaking in small parts second the important point after filling this epoxy resin near about four hour pass then it become little bit hard then it will not fell from here at that time I can remove this tape now it's 24 hour pass that's why it's become 100% hard epoxy resin and also stick or catch this tape with it that's why it's difficult to remove this tape is opening from this place but where this epoxy resin came out at that place very difficult to remove next most important point is the water leakage test so before rounding the copper pipe I must check the water leakage if any leakage then I have to solve that issue first because if I will round the pipe and connect with the system then if there is a leakage then there is a big problem to solve this issue I fix the box in its fitting so it will be easy to tight this cover I connect a small pump 25 watt this one to give the water because in actual I need to connect water pump NS803 that is 35 watt pump which give the water with pressure that's why I try to make the same situation to check the leakage now for just checking 5 seconds or 6 seconds if I put my finger in front of this end pipe to increase the pressure just for 5 seconds not more otherwise this pump can damage and just I put my finger the pump sound change because it increased the pressure but there is no leakage now I have placed this mark at this point and at this point so that I know till here I have to tight not more that inside rubber can damage and not less that water will leak this is the copper pipe which I brought to round on this box if we see its data it's 6 mm or 1 by 4 inch dia pipe 22 is the gauge I brought little bit good quality pipe otherwise if I bring thin quality or less quality then there is a chance of bend when I will move it up down or round it this complete one packing has 50 feet length of pipe this one and remaining this one 20 feet I brought separate now I shall join both of them then it becomes 70 feet total I must round minimum 60 feet length and maximum can be 80 feet so I brought 70 feet pipe if we see titanium operator original that has maximum I think 5 feet length but that is too much expensive as this titanium coil has the property to absorb the water heat very quick but with copper and SS box heat absorb capacity is not too good that's why we need to increase the pipe length to round this 70 feet pipe let's see the calculation here the height of this box is near about 200 mm but I will 
round till here because at this point the pipe can damage due to this sharp corners so if i round till here it's 190 mm is the height so little bit from here up side it becomes 190 mm height and for the dia of this box is it's 170 mm dia is 170 mm circumference i have to measure 2 pi r is the formula 21 inch pi will come on one round so 190 mm is the height 6 mm dia of pipe it means total 31 round can come if i round tightly layer wise if i give 31 round total length of pipe will be 31 multiplied by 21 equal to 651 inch in fit 54 fit start from here i open this screw and put this pipe here use this sleeve so that there is no chance to damage the pipe and then tight the screw now it's fixed here then it will be easy to round otherwise very difficult to round the pipe now full complete at this side bottom side here is the joint of 50 foot length this i put this pvc black color tape from this point i come on the upper layer so i put here double side tape this one to avoid any leakage or any rubbing or any puncture of this copper pipe in first bottom layer i complete 52 feet length and in upper near about 18 feet because total is 70 feet maybe i will open this one or two foot this will be extra because this pipe will go to the compressor section line and at this point i will connect the capillary tube and capillary will go till here so that cooling will start from this point must do the leaky test so i connect the compressor discharge pipe here connect this filter this is the arrow in and out must use this filter to stop the moisture oil and dust here otherwise it can go in our operator so after that i connect this red pipe on this gauge and this gauge yellow pipe is connected with capillary i have connected 36 number 5 fit capillary here and insert it till this point near about 2 fit length inserted and close this point and given pressure 245 psi after 30 minute it's still okay i round aluminium tape fully to fill pu foam i brought this dustbin according to my size of box cut from here to take out this pipe where i have connected the capillary and second downside i make a hole to take out this pipe this pipe is two feet maybe extra i have to cut and now i shall put here aluminium tape and then fill pu foam chemical from here and if we see from downside almost half inch space remaining and here i will fill the pu foam height was 95 mm so i put 50 mm but don't add 50 mm once because it will expand in five or six seconds then it will be waste so i added 25 mm from both bottles here in disposable cup and mix in six seconds i add from here and after that i put this paper here tightly otherwise it will come out then again i take 25 mm height mix and put from here after that i put this paper and put this wood sheet and press it forcefully now it become very hard i will not remove this sheet from here it's joint only remove this one and put here some proper tape and very careful while doing this one because it become hot and if you touch your hand then it's dangerous after one hour now it's become normal no temperature no nothing now it's become hard now i can clean this operator box fitting is completed its results are very good original titanium operator results can be very good but that is too much expensive so compared to its cost 
its results are very good next the steps to install this i will explain in next part because this video is already too long hope this video will help someone still if i did something wrong then please tell me in comments then i can also make it correct thanks for watching take care bye bye